welcome and welcome back to my channel it's your girl Ruby and today we're going to be doing a head wrap tutorial I've been getting a few questions on how I do my head wraps so I just wanted to share with y'all um, usually when I do my head wraps is because my hair is not braided and it's open I would just like braid like two braids at the moment I have two braids right now or just do chunky twists and I don't like to deal with it so <laughs> that's why I be having these so let's get into the video. So I'm going to be using these pom-poms that I made a while ago. Yeah. And I'm gonna be needing, I don't know what this is called. A wig cap. Yeah. So I put my pom-poms in the wig cap. I like using these pom-poms because they're soft. And it's very easy for them to like stay on my head. They're not heavy or anything. So I just put on my thing like this. Like I want it right there. Like I already did my edges, and then this is one of my favorite scarves. It's not even a scarf, in fact. This is um, it's more like a t-shirt material. It was really long because it used to be my mom's. So when I took it from her, I cut it into two pieces. And this is like one of my favorite ones that I always wear. Like, I'm literally always wearing this one. Why? Because I don't know. I'm such a person bitch sometimes. So we're gonna take it and then fold a little part in like this. And this part is going to go to the back. So we're gonna go like that, right? And then in front, we're gonna gather everything like this, and then we're gonna. Make sure our ears are fine and then we're gonna crisscross here in front. There you go. And then we're going to tie the little pieces to the back. I like this one because it's very easy. You don't really have to do too much because it's small fabric. It's not like you know a really really huge thing. I should do it. I don't really see what I'm doing in my back, so I use my fingers to do it. What are they doing? And just pray that it's alright. And voila! To reveal a bit of the edges, you can just push it back like that, and you're done. scarf and then I fold in a little bit like that and this part is going to go the front and we flip it and then we come and place it how we want it in front here and then at the back we're going to tie a knot and I tie it like that. Oh, I should have liked this one. Like that. So we're going to make a twist. We'll do this. Right, and then we're just going to We're going to place it nicely. Okay, we're going to place it like this. We got the sunshine by the poolside. Such a fun time living for the hot light. This is how I do it. Keep the free mind, yeah. Cause we got the sunshine by the poolside. Such a fun time living for the hot light. We're 
gonna take ah okay we're gonna fold in a little bit like that Come Make sure it's secure in place. Woo. I don't know why, but that's what I like. Okay, so now we're gonna do this one. Like that. I want this one to be like Come to see. And then we're going to be twisting. Oh, this is pretty. This one's going to be half over. There you go. It's not my favorite, but you get the juice. For clever we are, let's dance until dawn. Music on repeat, you can beat this feeling. This feeling. Let's keep this going on and on. Crack up the mon. Thank you so much for watching, and I hope you enjoyed learning how I do my hair drafts. Please do leave a comment down below commenting on which style that you like the most.